hello everyone in this video tutorial i will show you how you can make this kind of white menu with html and css and little bit of javascript uh, if you don't know the javascript you can just copy and paste Java, javascript code from the github repository i will include the link of this repository inside my video description please check out uh, just go to the repository repository i made from there you need to go uh, you need to go branch num branch number three mega menu html css javascript you can ju you can just go there and from this mega menu folder you can see the html uh, css and main.js all the code you can copy and paste otherwise you can just clone or download this total repository and use it for your own okay uh few more things to know that i will use visual studio code for this project you can use anything like sublime text atom or any code editor you want but i prefer a visual studio code for web developer this is totally free just go to google and search for bsc you will get the link at first just download this one download for windows okay enough talking let's start coding at first go to the desktop and create a new folder i'll name it mega and menu from there i will create two more folder sorry two more files names index.html index.html and style.css style.css okay press enter okay go to visual studio code from there go to file menu add folder to workspace from desktop i will add this one this mega menu i made the folder okay let's start coding from html just press shift and on and tab it will give the basic syntax uh, in visual studio code it will do automatically but if you are using atom or sublime text you need to install and add-ons or uh, extension whatever you call the extension name is emit e double m e t so just download it install it and you are ready to go okay let's make a header a c a d e r with id of s h o w c a s e showcase showcase tab because of the i am using sublime text uh, the emit is automatically installed in sublime text so i can use the shortcut if you can't use this shortcut you just install it by yourself extension name is emit okay navbar navbar i'll create a tag with class name of menu menu and for now i'll just make the a step default so it will not go anywhere okay first one will be home copy paste two more times 
second one will be about third one will be scr eics services but i will make an id here the id will be a a m e z a mega okay save below this three a tag i will create an div just write point d r o v d o w n hash for id id will be t d and tab okay make sure the class name and id are same so that when i will style and write script in javascript if you uh, if anything went wrong with you you can just copy and paste my codes that will run perfectly if the id and classes name are correct so make sure those name are correct exactly what i written there okay I C A D head R O W head R O T A B okay A L I A first one will be W B D E S I Z N web design sorry this head row will be uh, ui undecorated uh, ul sorry undecorated list okay and li stand for list item okay copy two more times and second one will be here you can write anything you want okay copy and paste this ul two more times below okay that's all for our html code this is very small but we forgot to add this style.css tag below this uh, title tag so just write link and tab stil style.css so we can style our style inside this style.css okay one more thing above the ending body tag i'll just write s c r i p t script all of my script i'll write here don't worry this is a uh, five or six line code it is not too hard okay let's work with css so M A R G I N zero E A double D I N G zero. Now let's work with the bar class dot N A V B A R. We name the class snapper here. Here this deep the class name was snapper. Make sure this name and this name is same okay e o s i t i o n position relative so our uh, we can make the child element position absolute height will be 70 pixel it will be 100 percent i on full width of my header never sorry 
color will be almost white VSCK zero in the background will be green okay let's see how it look now just go to the folder and double click on index.html if double click doesn't work just right click there and open with any web browser you want I will open with Google Chrome so now it look like this now okay we need to do more work on it okay now it's time to work with this showcase we name this ID showcase just copy this ID and above the navbar hashtag and showcase WID width will be hundred percent height will be hundred percent hundred view height that mean total uh, height of my window VSEK GRO UND background image I will set an image as my background URL name of the, my image FLO flower.jpg PSEK GRO UND background size will be cover C O V E R VSEKGROUND repeat no repeat VSEKGROUND background position will be center ok save it the reload the page let's see how it look now ok it look better ok let's work with menu and up working with the background image this time or let's work with menu menu this was the class name I name it the link ok M A R G I N margin top 28 pixel C O L O R color will be W S I T E white F L O A T float left so if we made float left so it will be line horizontally all of our a tag inside this nav bar it will line horizontally that means home service about it all of those will be line horizontally T E X T text decoration non T E X T transform uppercase all of our letter will be uppercase M A R G I N margin left thirty pixel okay save and reload the page let's see how it look it's look better the home about and services now looking horizontally and middle of this uh, vertical uh, vertical vertically okay let's work with drop down here the class was drop down okay let's work with it dot remember when you work with 
class you need to give an dot before the class name when you work with id you need to give an hash before the id okay POSI position absolute top 70 pixel LEFT left 10 percentage ACIGST height 200 pixel box sizing box si bor border box psc kgr ont background rgb 10 comma 56 comma 2 died okay For now, made it DISPLAI display and no any. Okay, let's make a comment here. With JVSCRIPT, no, no, we will. Uh, uh, we will t urn on d i s p l a i s b l o c k okay so we will not forget that if i uh, if we comment Okay, let's see how it's looking now. Refresh the page. It's not showing because we say display is none. Okay, comment it out and refresh once again. This is how it's looking now. Don't worry, we'll restyle it once again. Okay. Let's work with head row mm, dot head row FLO AT float left MARGIN left thirty pixel a list item list sorry list sti list style none text transform uppercase text trns from u uppercase margin to e margin top 10 pixel p a d o d i n g t o p 2 8 pixel save and let's see how it's looking now reload the page it's not showing once again we made the display as none comment it out to see it's looking better you see this is the menu what we added but we had little bit interactivity okay um, now it's time to work with attack color will be rgb rgb 255 255 255 
this is white text decoration will be none save okay now it's time to work with javascript as i say before if you don't like javascript you can copy and paste the code from my github repository i added the link of github repository below you need to go this repository and from um, from the branch number four you can find this project you just copy those script and paste it here i will write by myself c o n s t m e g a d o c u m e n t dot g t element by id remember we name an id m e g a where is that let's see look for the id mega this one okay we are selecting this one uh, we'll select two more c o n s t s h o w c a s c equal d o c u m e n t dot g t element by id id will be s h o w c a s c showcase and c o n s t d r o p drop means drop down d o c u m e n t dot g t e d m e n t by id the id was d d okay let's work with this mega menu this mega id this was the a for link this is the link okay let's work with this mega m e g a dot add event listener the event will be on m o u s e over o v e r mouse over comma uh, make an arrow function here i will change the display as none uh, remove the comment when we will mouse over this mega mega link our menu will be pop up okay drop drop dot stoyle dot disp display is equal block okay let's add an event listener for our window w n d o w window dot add event listener window mean the whole window we see in our web browser this one will be click event click comma e this parameter means it will target our uh, our element okay if e dot t a r get is equal equal s h o w showcase then d r o p dot s t i l e style dot display is equal n o n any okay save now reload the page how it look now reload when we hover over this 
services it will pop up and right click uh, outside sorry click outside this uh, this menu it will go away okay that's all for this tutorial if you like this tutorial please like this video comment if you, if anything went wrong please let me know and if you need any help you can comment it down i will help you of course i will reply your comment as soon as possible and subscribe my channel that is the price of my hard work thank you